Sandy Ingram here. Welcome. In the comments section, people ask on different videos what the video has to do with the RV or the Iraqi dinar revalue. And I always reply, everything. Guys, this is how the Forex market works. Now, just because Iraq is not on the Forex market does not mean that they are not creating a Forex market chart. For example, on or around December 7th, the president of Peru did something that upset the people. He was ousted out of office. Protests have continued since that time and the U.S. state government has issued a travel alert for Peru. American tourists are stuck in Peru because the airport was closed down at one point. But look at Peru's month-long chart against the U.S. dollar. Can you tell which day during the month that their political turmoil, their political issues in the country cause severe problems with their currency value against the U.S. dollar and other currencies around the world. As shown by the increase on the chart, which really represents a decrease in the value against the dollar. Yes, the CBI of Iraq on paper has the control over the RV. But in reality, what happens in the country determines their, the CBI's, reality. The weekly change in the Iraqi stock market last week was between 0.5% and minus 2.6%. The weekly trading volume was at 4 billion IQD or 2.6 million U.S. dollars. Now, because of my legal limitations to discuss investments, I will say to you once again, you can find some of the top stocks on regular stock trading platforms like eToro to trade stocks in Iraq. In order to use the company shown on your screen, it would cost you 20,000 US dollars to open an account. Remember, always remember that corruption is alive and well in Iraq. 